once you get exposed to a sexually transmitted disease, you are at higher risk that you might carry other STDs. Means if somebody has one STD, that person is in higher chance and probability that have other STDs as well. That's not necessarily 100% fact in every case, but it could be a, a general rule of treating patient with a sexual transmitted disease. This is an example. You know, this patient presented to me and has, and he thought he has a, a genital wars, but he was diagnosed with genital wars. But I look at the patient, the patient has two different STDs. These are genital warts and these are uh, molascum contagiosum. They're completely different virus. They are not related to each other. They are different type of the virus. Um, but treatment we offer was is usually similar treatment. Works very well on both of them and HPV BCR. And we treat this patient for all of them. And it's been, as you see, this um, uh, patient has been tried to treat this and has a spell of uh, some uh, acid and give you hyperpigmentation. That is the pigment loss because of the acid. And um, the patient was treated, but this is the case that explained that we have one STD, there is a possibility you get exposure to other STD. It's just because of the uh, risk, risky behavior, patient who doesn't use protection or has multiple partners, might get one STD from one partner, another STD from other partner, but on the third partner, he would be probably transmit both of them to the third party. So uh, that would be the example of multiple STD exposure.